Hi QTC people, welcome to this video. This video is about Tech Mahindra Robot Framework real interview questions for 6 to 13 years experienced. Domain knowledge questions. So explain your network domain knowledge. And second one is any network any knowledge on telecom domain. So they are expecting knowledge on network and telecom domain. Testing interview questions. So the first one is explain why software testing is important. Software testing is needed for the applications scalability and maintainability. So in order to Avoid the breakups of any 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 pages or any calls, any uh, additional functions, any anything is avoided in a, a with the help of testing. So that is the need for testing. Second one is how you do security testing and software. So how you do the basic authentication, authorization, how it is made for a project, how the uh, uh, setup they do for security is need to be discussed here. Automation testing questions. So you need to explain end-to-end -end test so end-to-end -end testing so involves all module testing functionality testing integration testing everything and second one is what is exploratory testing robot framework questions so first one is how to open failed logs in robot framework so it will be available in the logs so second one is explain robot framework architecture the full architecture will explain here third one is how to connect robot framework with the mongodb so for saving the data is needed for testing we can use robot framework or else sometimes we can need to be handled the data, uh, large number of data to be stored in mongodb that for that purpose we need to know how it is connected to the, the robot framework fourth one is what are the types of variables available fifth one is how to create test case using write so write is an important question test case the creation and execution we need to explain all the steps Last one is a scenario question. I have a page which contains a timer which runs up to 8 minutes and that have 20 fields including all types of elements in HTML. How can I ensure the testers add all the data in the field and use the timer efficiently? The tester form filler should stay in the page for 8 minutes. So they have a timer which will ask the which will set the user of that particular page to set for 8 minutes and that there are 20 fields. The 20 fields will be um, filled in order to uh, 20 fields should be filled and 8 minutes should be spent on the page in order to get to the next page so they are asking to write automation code or suggest some testing techniques to ensure this case so we also you need to use the timer techniques and the time uh, we need to ensure that the timer is fully running when, once we are running into the page we are, we, once we are coming to the page to that to from that we need to add some timer points and the timer points will, will come up to eight minutes and uh, we can make sure that the eight minutes is particularly crossed for this particular page and uh, all the other fields we can use uh, we can have all our own uh, type of uh, testing uh, techniques right input box uh, and slide box what are all the things we can do with testing that is not an issue for us but for the timing we can have to use a timer Python programs so they have given a program so string program which should print like G G R G R A G R M G R A M pro P G R A M P R G R A M P R O so which is like we need to use a for loop we need to find the string of the length and with the string of the length we need to start from the middle n by 2 okay and then we need to print to the nth element that is n by 2 -th element that is middle element question so all these questions they ask ask to write examples so first one is to wrap to Python boolean values without using third variable which means we have a true and false this true and false should be swapped without using the third variable and the second one is what are closures and decorators third one is what is at static method at class method fourth one is have you achieved deep copy and shallow copy in python fifth one is have you test your automation test cases using pytest that is for unit testing Last one is what are mutable and immutable objects. So these are the basic Python things. So please go through the questions once and prepare according to it. HR questions. So how you prepare yourself for software tester interview? So we will go through all the manual testing parts, manual testing based questions, automation testing questions, basic testing uh, questions, and then we can focus on our own uh, uh, software at uh, testing software. So which will be python robot framework or selenium or any ipm or school or any kind of things uh, and then we can have some basic uh, uh, this scenario based questions if you are choosing a robot framework we need to focus on python also 
and if you are choosing Cyrillic, we need to be uh, have knowledge on Java or Python or uh, Ruby like that. Based on that, we need to prepare. Second one is how do you involved in developing application testing from scratch? Yes, I have involved in that one. So based on your experience, you can see that one. How you do communication with your clients? How you raise and resolve queries? So communication with clients is needed for testers in order to maintain the particular decorum of the project. So we need the, we need this one. So the communication with the clients, we need to note all the uh, whenever a module is going to be started, we need to be uh, fully go through the documents and we need to raise what are the things we need uh, for the document, what are the doubts we have. We need to do down on everything and we need when the client call, we need to ask them one by one what are the things we need clarity. And based on that clarity, we need to get the document and we need to insist the developers to do that also. Thanks for watching the video. Please like, comment, share and subscribe to Singlabs 8